Five things are heating up quite a bit in the race for governor and Governor Bruce Rauner taking off the gloves in his attacks on his chief Democratic rival, J.B. Pritzker. In fact, this weekend, the governor will be airing a 14-minute long commercial of a conversation between Pritzker and convicted former governor, Rob Lagojevich. Eyewitness News political reporter Craig Wall here now with this story. Craig. Alan, the Rauner campaign will be taking what is being described to me as an unprecedented step for a primary by buying airtime in TV stations across the state to air in its entirety an 11-minute FBI wiretap conversation between J.B. Pritzker and Rob Blagojevich. This is the unedited J.B. Pritzker, Rod Blagojevich, FBI wiretap. The 11-minute phone call between Rod Blagojevich and J.B. Pritzker was recorded November 6, 2008, as the FBI was investigating Blagojevich for pay-to-play politics. Governor Rauner first released a one-minute attack ad using some of that wiretap, which Pritzker complained was an edited snippet. The new ad is a response. Pritzker said he wanted this wiretap to be released in full. Be careful what you ask for. The people of Illinois need to know the truth about the corruption in our state. That's what that's about. The ad is slated to air on TV stations in major markets around the state this weekend. In it, Blagojevich and Pritzker can be heard talking about possibilities of Pritzker being appointed to the U.S. Senate seat, being vacated by Barack Obama, or possibly as state treasurer or attorney general. Governor Blagojevich spoke with hundreds of people at that time, and bottom line is I was never accused of any wrongdoing. This is a governor who's trying to distract from his failed record. It shows how pathetic our system is, how broken. Anyone who would use an excuse and say, well, I did something immoral, unethical, disgusting, and self-dealing, but I didn't go to jail, so it's okay. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? You know, he can run a 30-second ad or a 30-minute ad. He's not going to be able to distract from his own failures. But the truth of the matter is he's coming after me in this Democratic primary because he knows he'll lose the general election to me. Before a Democratic candidate's forum at Access Living, Pritzker's chief rivals in the upcoming primary weighed in on the details of the wiretap and their implications in the governor's race. It just shows what a risk it would be for the Democratic Party to nominate a flawed candidate like J.B. Pritzker. J.B.'s unfortunately emerging as the poster child for everything the Republicans say is wrong about Democratic politicians. The notion that, well, it's a combination of money and insiders who benefit. I asked Pritzker today whether he wished the conversation with Blagojevich never happened. He repeatedly avoided a direct answer, but when I pressed him on it, Pritzker said Blagojevich broke the trust of the people of Illinois and, in his words, is in prison where he belongs. Immediately this afternoon, Pritzker himself released another digital ad attacking Rauner. Got a nasty primary here. Yeah, we sure, sure do. Okay. All right.